So you recorded the perfect video. You got all your lines right. Now you go to edit and you want to put a little bit of music to it just to soften it up a little bit. How do you do that in Canva? I'll show you how. So the first thing you're going to need to do is upload your video. I have already uploaded one that I've done a long time ago. It was a little short that I did of my little dog. Um, so we'll play a little bit of that real quick. You want some cheese? So now say I want to kind of soften it up a little bit. So you can either upload, you can go into your audio if you have something uploaded that you want to use, upload your file if you needed to, and then use something out of there. Or you can go into the Canva library and come down to audio and pick you out. If you know any of my videos, I always use this one club. So that's what I'm going to do here. So if you have a particular point in your video where you want the music to come in, you can have your little pointer, arrow, line, whatever you want to call this right here, at the point where you want to start. So if you want to start here, if you wanted to start at the beginning, wherever you want to do. So say I wanted to start my music right here. So when I do, I'll have that there. And then what I'll do is I pop this in like this, and that's where my music will start. The other thing is, is if you decide you don't want to start it there and you want to go to the beginning, you can pull it up. Um, if you kind of shorten it up because you don't want it there. And you can also drag it back and forth into spots. So the main thing you want to do is you don't want your music to overpower what you're saying in your video or whatever sounds are going on in your video. So to do that, what you want to go do is go up to audio effects. I always like to, go to put a good fade in and a good fade out when I'm doing something like a tutorial or something. Um, if you just want something playing all the way through the background, you don't have to do that if you don't want to. My personal thing for when I'm speaking or anything like that and I add music, I like to take the volume down to like 13. I think 13 is a good number between that. So let's go and listen to what 13 sounds like with this video. You want some cheese? You want cheese? Already? So as you can see, you can still hear what I'm saying, which having a light musical background in the background without the music overshadowing what you're saying within your video. So that is a good thing. You can also layer them up if you would like another track if you to uh, do that. If you have your audio already in there, like uh, let's say you have your audio outside of canva where you made a voiceover or something you can go that and then you can do that and and put those well that's that small but but what you can do is you still you can sit there and adjust that audio too and so i don't even know what that is so you want cheese so like if that's too loud we can like take that down even further like i said to me for some reason 13 is my number i like 13. so We'll get that and listen to that. You want quick. cheese? And you can hear that little sound. Already? But it doesn't overpower. And the uh, same thing for that. So if with your whole video, if you want to do that and you want to take the volume down on your whole video, you can also do it with your whole video too. So if you want to kind of balance them out a little bit more, you can take that, also take that audio down. So you can make a good balance between the two. So that is a personal preference up to you, of you. Um, that is how you do this little trick. Very easy, simple to do. And that is my tutorial. And I thank you for stopping by. And I will give you much, 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 much love. And have a good day.